Thank you for choosing Easy Robotech Technical Support for ELV Systems. In this video we will learn how to update the firmware for Bose Power Match configurable professional power amplifiers. Each power match amplifier contains user updatable files, firmware files. These files can be updated from Control Space Designer software. Using a PC connected to either the USB on the front panel of the amplifier or in the case of a network version amplifier, an Ethernet network connection. However in the previous video, we have seen how to change the static IP address to the same amplifier. Without any ado let's start the video. As you know how to detect the amplifier in the network. If you want to know the details, please watch my previous video. The link given in the description. Once you find the device in the network, right click on the device and then go to Properties of the Amplifier. Then go to the Hardware Manager. Then go to the Firmware Update tab. Here users will have the information related to the present firmware, and the latest firmware. As you can see on the screen I have 2.111 loaded in the amplifier, and the latest version in 3.750. And the status also, out of date. It means the firmware version if no more compatible with the control space software. To update to the latest version select the amplifier from the list. And then click on the update button. Meanwhile let me bring the live status of the amplifier, at hardware end. Once the user clicks on the update, the amplifier will give the notification on its screen, that the firmware update in process, as you can see on my screen. While it's updating, make sure you should not power off the amplifier. Now we have the hardware started updating firmware, wait till it reaches 100%. Once the update is completed, a pop-up window will open, and it will ask the permission for the reboot of the hardware. Click on Yes, to start rebooting the device. As you can see on my screen. Once the hardware is restarted, close to all this window, and again go back to device properties, and then go to hardware manager, then go to the firmware tab. Here the user will have the updated amplifier. If you see on the screen the loaded firmware version, and latest firmware version is the same. And the status is up to date in the green indication. It means our upgradation process is completed, and it's working fine. I hope you learn how to update the firmware for the Power Match Amplifier, from Bose. Thank you for watching this video. Please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to my channel.